Now something else that's really useful to know about your Mac is that you can customize so many things and so many keys when it comes down to it. So for example, maybe you have a smaller MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, and you want more space on your screen, and you don't want to view this the whole time, because you may not need to view this the whole time, every single icon you guys have down here. Well, there's a way around that, so we're gonna go into System Preferences. Now again, if you don't see System Preferences down here, you can always look for that up here in your Spotlight Search. So what we want to look for is our third option up here, Dock and Menu Bar, just tap on it. And this is something that most people use, but you don't have to if you don't want to. Automatically hide and show the dock. So down here below, we can go ahead and hide that dock if we don't want it. So we're gonna go ahead and click right there. What does that do? Well, I'm gonna click and unclick there so you guys can see what happens. See how it disappears? That's what it does. So let's say I made it hide. What happens? Well, if I scroll all the way down, it's just gonna appear. So that's what I'm doing. As long as I'm not touching that, then it's just gonna disappear. However, if I go down with my mouse, all the way down, I'm gonna see everything that I want. Now something else that's pretty cool that I like to activate is up here, magnification. So I'm gonna put a check mark right there. And what this does is this. So now that I scroll down, it's gonna magnify everything. Now, in my case, I think that's a little bit too big, but some people may like that. We can adjust that, so I can adjust to the middle-ish. So now that if we go down, they just go up a little bit more. So it kind of highlights what you're scrolling over. I'm gonna go over a little bit more, and there we go. So right now it's highlighting what I'm gonna select. Now this is pretty useful, again, if you have a 13 inch, uh, it's pretty nice that this will highlight what you're scrolling over. So that's a quick tip for you to customize and further customize your Mac. So for now, we're just gonna close this up. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.